There's uh, there's music in here. <laughs> First time all season. Yeah. Do you get to pick it? <laughs> nice to hear it though. Yeah. Nice to get the first one. How does it feel? Yeah, it feels good, man. It feels good to uh, taste that victory. Just, uh, you know, feel good for the guys. You know, we've been working hard for this. Jeremy, with all the stuff that's gone on the last couple of weeks, how important was it to get that? Yeah, I mean, with all that other stuff, that's, you know, we have nothing to do with any of that stuff as, as football players, so it, it really didn't matter. You know, the, our record and where we're at right now, that was that was what we were worried about, just getting a win. But it, it feels good. And I guess in the East now, too, I mean, you need one, but if you get three, you get three more, I mean, you're right in the thick of it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I mean, we realize that, but, you know, right about now, there's I don't think we're, we're ready for that conversation. It's more of, uh, you know, just focus on this next game. Can you guys relax? Relax, for lack of a better word, now, Jeremiah, going into your next game now in Ottawa. No, G given no, that you have the win, and that's not ho ho being held over you anymore. I mean, yeah, I think it's the opposite of that. I mean, we don't, you know, you shouldn't relax. You should, you know, step on the gas and, and work even harder now that we have this W and we're still in it. You know, I don't think it's time to relax. I think it's time to go. But you know, we can't, we can't put, you know, extra pressure on ourselves. Like right. we can't just. The long play to speed seemed to be that the spark that that sort of things got better after that. Is yeah. that how did you how did you see that coming? Did you how did you set that up? And how, can you talk about the play itself? Yeah, well, we I mean, you know, we're we're attacking them vertically and uh, you know getting getting a lot of uh, my man Brian right there. <laughs> but but. Uh, but uh, sorry, I'm distracted by my man too here. Um, but yeah, we, going we after got, him got, vertically. We, yeah, yeah, we got we got rolling after that. Uh, it was definitely something that you know we, that, that sparked us for sure. But um, you know, we had open plays before that. Man, I had some bad throws in the beginning of the game. Um, you know, but that, that's just football, man. I mean, I was proud of our team how we just battled back no matter what happened. That play looked like it actually looked like you overthrew him. I don't know if you could see it from there. And then oh, it was no just overthrowing speedy. Well, that was it, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, he kind of like jogged when he got to the ball. You know, that's how fast he is. So. You want to ask a question, Brian? Oh uh, yeah, uh, Masoli. What's up, man? How did you feel about that weather at halftime? <laughs> oh man, that was uh, that was awesome. That was fun, man. He came in here and had some fun. You know, my man Brian Timms was dancing in here the whole time. It was Cool. Yeah, I heard it, Brian. He's a he's a really attractive guy. I don't know about all that. <laughs> <laughs> he's a hell of a player. <laughs> was the break helpful? Uh, you thought it was helpful the defense in particular, just enabled to sort of a second game planning session and just get guys calmed down a little bit. I, yeah, I, I think it was the, the same for us on offense too. You know, there was there were things out there that we were leaving on the field. You know, before that 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 break there. Um, and we were able to see it on the iPad and stuff and just, you know, talk to each other and just calm down and know that we had our plays that were going to work, you know, versus their scheme. Um, but like I said earlier, you know, that was a good defense that we just played. You know, they, they're a hard-nosed defense, and uh, you know, it was a battle tonight. I said relax earlier. It wasn't the point they made. I didn't yeah. know that, but what's going to be like now to build off a victory and not another loss? Yeah, exactly. I mean, um, you know, anytime you win, obviously it feels great, and this is our first one of the year, so, you know, we're just going to try to keep it going, and all the stuff we did last week, just do a little more of it this week and, and hopefully get another one. Did it help, like, you guys went through this last year with a long delay? Everything. Did, did, did it help to just kind of know how to handle it, I guess? Yeah, for sure. I think last year, I think, uh, and I speak for a lot of guys, are saying we didn't handle it that well. Um, but this, this this time around, we definitely handled it well. The guys that were still on the team from last year, you know, remember what happened last year, and we kind of tied ourselves out just, you know, waiting for the game to start instead of just being relaxed and composed and, you know, not worrying about what's not in our control. Is it hard? Like, it has to be, to me, like, to not better, I think it would seem like just a big disruption in the, the rhythm and your routine and everything. How, how hard is it to deal with? I think it was harder for them. You know, they were they were in a pretty decent rhythm on their side. You know, we were down 6-0, and um, our defense was playing really well. You know, we put them on a on a short field a couple of times there as an offense. Um, but you know, it was, it was good for us to kind of regroup and and just calm down, like I said, and settle in.